white flag raised. And they're off. Pretty even break for most of these debutants. And the first to stride is Verne in company with Angel's Feather and Lady Skipper and Olivia Moralda in company with Statuette and in between Queen of Carts. So down the hill they continue to race and Queen of Carts the overall leader with Verne on its inside. Then comes Statuette in company with Olivia Moralda, Lady Skipper on the inside, Angel's Feather. And tracking Angel's Feather is Silmania. And then comes Giselle's Romance and Miss Langmore. So down the hill and onto the racetrack proper and our leader in the centre of the track, Queen of Carts. For company, about half a length back is Verne, stand side. The big statuette in company with Olivia Moralda. In behind those is Lady Skipper, but Queen of Carts skips a length clear to Olivia Moralda stand side in company with statuette. Verne under pressure. Then comes Angel's Feather. Silmania stand side in the Aga Khan silks. So inside the final quarter a mile and through the dip, but Olivia Moralda hits the front. But quickly the move is covered by statuette. Olivia Moralda statuette. Then Silmania inside the final furlong. And Olivia Moralda tackled by statuette the far side. Statuette and Olivia Moralda. Statuette hits the front and goes on by a length and a half and Statuette, the daughter of the triple group one winner, Immortal Verse, strides clear and hits the line impressively. Second, Olivia Moralda, Silmania, Verne, Queen of Carts. Brian, <laughs> we have to talk to you about this, Philly. She looked very, very impressive. How did you find that from her? Yeah, look, nice to start off on some nice ground and... Um, <laughs> Lovely, lovely big filly. Uh, she, you know, she stand out really physically. Um, she, she done that, done that really nicely. And um, you know, she's she's justify out of immortal verse. So she has like a incredible pedigree. And um, you know, I'd, I'd like to think, looking at the size of her, she'll um, she'll continue to progress through the. Second, as we know, had a really good run in what looked a fair main at the Curra last week. The form stacks up. Had you had much to do with her before today? It was a performance that I anticipated, do you think? I, I, I don't know if it was anticipated or not, but um, she's a filly that Aidan liked and um, very happy to watch her. Excited by her? Yeah. Thanks, Ryan.